Discover Your Health is brought to you by Secure money at retirement with the Smart Retirement Plan from NCB Insurance Company Limited, meeting your needs. Chicken pox, which is caused by the virus cell virus, is highly contagious and it can spread quickly. The virus is transmitted by direct contact with the rash or by droplets dispersed into the air by coughing or sneezing. Your risk of catching chickenpox is higher if you haven't been vaccinated for chickenpox, work in or attend a school or a child care facility, or live with children. The signs and symptoms of chickenpox are a red itchy rash initially resembling insect bites on your face, scalp, chest and back, small liquid filled blisters that break open and cross over, a fever, abdominal pain or loss of appetite, a mild headache and general feeling of unease or discomfort or irritability. Once infected, you can spread the virus for up to 48 hours before the rash appears and you remain contagious until all spots crossed over. In otherwise healthy children, chickenpox typically requires no medical treatment. Your doctor may prescribe an antihistamine to relieve itching, but for the most part, the disease is allowed to run its course. For people who have a higher risk of complications from chickenpox, doctors sometimes prescribe medications to shorten the duration of the infection and help reduce the risk of complications. Chickenpox is normally a mild disease, but it can be serious and can lead to complications especially in these high-risk groups. Newborns and infants whose mothers never had chickenpox or the vaccine, adults, pregnant women, and people whose immune systems are impaired by medications such as chemotherapy or other disease. A common complication of chickenpox is a bacterial infection of the skin. Chickenpox may also lead to pneumonia or, rarely, an inflammation of the brain called encephalitis, both of which can be very serious. To help ease the symptoms of an uncomplicated case of chickenpox, follow these self-care measures. Don't scratch. Scratching can cause scarring, slow down the healing process and increase the risk that sores will become infected. Relieve the itch and other symptoms. For relief, try a cool bath with added baking soda or uncooked oatmeal. Calamine lotion may be dabbed on the spots. Antihistamines may also be used for itching, but check with your doctor to make sure your child can safely take antihistamines. A soft, bland diet should be adhered to if chickenpox sores develop in the mouth. Don't give aspirin to anyone with chickenpox because it can lead to a serious condition called Ray syndrome. And don't try to treat a high fever without consulting your doctor. Discover Your Health was brought to you by Secure money at retirement with the Smart Retirement Plan from NCB Insurance Company Limited, meeting your needs.